Hey guys, I'm Trina and today I'm going to explain how you can set up a shadow command in stream elements. Stream smarter, not harder. But before we begin, I stream every Tuesday, Friday and Sunday, 8pm Century European time on twitch.tv slash jury, link is underneath in the description. A bit ago, I made a video about how to set up a shadow commands on the Streamlabs chatbot, and I asked you guys, would you be interested in seeing one for stream elements? And you guys all said yes! So here we are today, and I'm gonna show you. The first thing we do is go to stream elements and click on my dashboard, or log in with your Twitch. Then on the left here, we scroll all the way down until we see something called commands. It is right here. Then we go to custom commands and click on the button add new command. We will choose a command name, which I recommend either taking SO or shout out. I like to use SO just to keep it short. And then on the right here, make sure to set this on moderator. So not everybody can give shout outs, but only your moderators. And then as a response, I have head over and check out dollar sign one, uh, the least place dollar sign game at twitch.tv slash dollar sign one. So what it says, this is a piece of code which will stand for a name. So it will say head over and check out streamer's name. So this part is a game one is playing. So they last played and then the game the streamer was playing. At twitch.tv slash again the name of the person that's being used in the shadow. What you can do is basically all this stuff you can change. So you can make this totally different. As long as you keep this part, which is the na streamer's name, you don't have to have the game in here, but I recommend you do because I really like when a uh, mod gives a shout out for somebody who rated me that I can ask questions about the games they were playing. And then this part is the most important part, which is the link of them. Of course, you're doing a shout out, you want their link to be displayed. So make sure that this part, twitch.tv slash one is the same. I will copy this and leave this down in the description below for you guys to copy, but you can all just change the text in it if you want to personalize it. So for example, we can make check out. Go check out. And now it says go check out the streamer's name. And then they were chilling with, they were chilling with, and then the game name. For example, go check out Trui. They were chilling with Mario Make at twitch.tv slash tree. Like I said, I will just copy this and leave this down in the description below for you to copy it and paste it. And then it's just easy peasy. Just make a command, name it SO or shout out, set it on moderator and paste the whole stuff and then activate command. My command is right here. Make sure that it is enabled because otherwise, well, it wouldn't pop up. Now we want to test the alert. Always test your things, guys. Boom. So we're at my channel and I'm typing exclamation mark so truey head over and check out truey they last played mario kart 8 at twitch.tv slash truey that seems to work be aware though if you do so at truey the link will not work so if you do this at truey the link will also be twitch.tv slash at truey so if you go here you will not actually end up at my stream so make sure that if you don't know how to write somebody's name and you do add in front of it that you remove the ad before actually making the shout out command because the link will just be <laughs> the link will not work otherwise i hope this was helpful leave a comment down below and i will see you in one of my many stream elements tutorials see you there